Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we'll explain how to use the ultrasonic ringing module, and we need to prepare Raspberry Pi, HCSR04, and power supply cable. First, we need to connect the wire, connect 5 volt and GND. The pin streak and echo of the ultrasonic module can be connected to any GPIO pin of the Raspberry Pi. Our connection method is shown in the figure. If your connection method is different from ours, that's okay. Just Remember the corresponding BCM pin code to the trick and echo. You can refer to these methods to send the program to the Raspberry Pi to run. Next, we explain the program. Import the library that controls the pins of Raspberry Pi and instantiate them at the same time. Import the time library and use it to control the delay time. Here, we define the BCM coding for the pins trick and echo. If your connection way is different, you need to change these two numbers. Write a function to initialize the trick and echo. Here we write a function to get the distance information. First, send a pulse signal of 10 microseconds to the trick. After receiving the pulse signal, the ultrasonic module starts to emit ultrasonic waves. When the ultrasonic module starts to emit ultrasonic waves, the echo will be set to high level. Here we get the time of the moment the ultrasonic emits signal. A while loop waits for the ultrasonic signal to return. When the ultrasonic signal returns, the echo is set to low. Jump out of the while loop and get the time of the moment the ultrasonic receives. Return this value. Next, run this program. Initialize the pin, get the distance datum every 0.5 seconds and print it out. You can also use our ultrasonic module and LED strip to do some interesting experiments combining with our previous tutorial on controlling LED lights. Here's the code for this little experiment. 